Hello, my name is Bo Green, and this is the thing that started everything. My grandpa taught me how to fish before I could walk, and then I became obsessed with fishing. So much that I had to learn more, and I obtained my master's degree in marine biology. After graduating and seeing some of the most pristine reefs in the world, I was hooked on traveling. But traveling is expensive. So I decided to work on yachts, and then I made my own yacht and sailed all around the world. Not bad, Not bad at all. Well, it wasn't right, exactly a sailing yacht, but you get the picture. I cruised all around the United States visiting every place that I could. And then, there was one state I hadn't visited. Hawaii. This trip to Kauai completely changed my life. It made me focus on personal relationships and stray away from social media. It also made me decide to fly to New Zealand and boy was this a surprise they just can't avoid a McDonald's around here I didn't last too long before I had to go island hopping I checked out some caves met some new friends the middle of a cave there's a cave that way there's the skylight there's a cave that way so cool this is the view from the top of Rangitoto. We decided to hike over to Motutapu all on the same day. After building up the courage, I went on a little adventure of my own. This place absolutely blew my mind. I never thought that New Zealand would be like this at all. There was crazy awesome wildlife around me and I decided to hop on in the Pacific. The bus driver was so cool, he was even down to wait for me. Then I took a flight over to Queenstown, and boy, those bathrooms were nice. I flushed the toilet, of course, to check if it spun the other way, and wow, what a beautiful view. Checked into my hostel, was right on the water, and let's go. From Queenstown, I decided to go to Milford Sound. We're up here at the tour bus. And I met some friends along the way. We just got some ice cream in there. You ever had the uh, Pokey Pokey? Definitely try it out. Four dollars over here, pretty solid deal. Oh yeah, I gotta show you something. Are you doing a video? I ate some exotic like fruit. Spiky. It looks like Mrs. Puff from SpongeBob. I made new friends. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Wait, the, the this is Yanina. Can you, can you uh, say some things about yourself? Um, I'm Janina, I'm German, um, I just met this guy <laughs> So this is Milford Sound. It's actually should be renamed because it's a fjord. And if you don't know what a fjord is, it basically is a area carved out from glaciers. And what comes with glaciers is beautiful, pristine waterfalls. Lots of them. We got the waterfall, we're getting juicy. juicy. Thanks to the Juicy crew and this certified badass, Kelsey, I was inspired to hop in. I'm not gonna lie, I was pretty hesitant before going on this tour because of the price, but I'm so glad that I did. I mean, where else can you see waterfalls with the backdrop of dolphins and seals in the same spot? When we returned to Queenstown, I hiked up to the gondola, witnessed this beautiful view, and then went down to the park with Kelsey. Then I went on to join her to Wanaka. She rented a car and I needed a ride, and it started a beautiful friendship. We camped out at the trailhead and woke up at 3 a.m. and hiked four hours just to see the sunrise in Roy's Peak. And it was freaking gorgeous, but also really, really cold. I mean, this is me trying to woof a smile. But it was crazy. We hiked down about 45 minutes, actually we kind of ran, until we got to Lake Wanaka. And it was warm enough to just hop right in with our bathing suits on. Yeah, buddy. 
Then we headed north to the beautiful glacial lakes of Lake Tecapo and Lake Pukaki. Can you this place? Pukaki? Pukaki. Pukaki. Lake Pukaki. After checking out the local church and going on the swing, we decided to head up north to Christchurch. But it was a little too city for us. So we went out camping over in Taylor's Mistake Beach. Kelsey dropped me off at the Christchurch airport. We said our goodbyes, and this lovely gentleman convinced me to go hitchhiking. Alrighty, I'm going hitchhiking. But that's a totally different story, and that'll be for next time. So, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to continue on this adventure to Kaikura!